This resolution includes more self-care in your life. Pinellas County art therapist created what she calls a spa day for the soul. What started out as self-care workshops are now available as artistic expression kits for at-home use. Third Main Design Tools I can introduces us to the founder of Painting Your Soul. Every brush stroke brings Karen Hanlon peace. You get real quiet with yourself when you're painting, and you actually can find some of these answers when you're that quiet. Quiet. And connecting through color, says Hanlon, who lets the canvas help her release. Ten years ago, I went through a very difficult transition in my life, and I gravitated to art and journaling specifically to help with uh, letting go and helping with some anxiety that I was dealing with. Hanlon wanted to help others heal. She founded Painting Your Soul, the artistic self-care kit takes users on a journey of self-expression. Painting Your Soul is a very unique process that helps you really connect deeply with yourself through art and uh, journaling, essential oils, affirmations, and meditation. The former educator, now certified art therapy practitioner, says art had a profound effect on her students. Now she feels the impact personally. And each time you do this, you're letting go of layers within yourself. As Hanlon continues capturing her soul on canvas. Don't judge what you feel, just write down your feelings and start getting that out. Write on paper everything you're feeling in this moment. She helps others learn how to peel back the layers in workshops like this. The artistry isn't necessarily what's important. It's about the fact that they're letting go through the paint strokes and the writing. Both of them together will help you connect, find a sense of peace, a new perspective, and the possibility of some new beginnings. With the sound of waves crashing, participants write, relax, and meditate before brush strokes bring emotions to the easel. It feels really nice being a, a person that has ADHD. My mind goes around a minute, 100 miles a minute. <laughs> so I don't ever have time to like just stop. Taking time to stop, Hanlon says, is essential for everyone. Jennifer Winchester has embraced it after dealing with challenges getting her business off the ground. Sometimes we don't really take the time to acknowledge the progress that we've done for ourselves and it's really helped to bring that up to, you know, for me. Creating inner peace on the canvas. Really trudging through what I thought was impossible. Self-discovery, Hanlon says, that can help heal. The mission is to help people let go and connect through creative expression. A journey of mindfulness meant to create a new path, a personal masterpiece. In Pinellas County, Melissa Eichmann, Spectrum News. A local nonprofit.